My name is Amanda Sheehan and I'm a nurse practitioner at Joslin Diabetes Center in Boston and I'm going to be talking about how to obtain CGM coverage for your patients. In this section I'll be talking about how to obtain CGMs for patients who have coverage through Medicare and Medicaid. So with Medicare, CGM coverage is considered a durable medical benefit. So what are the Medicare requirements? As of July 2021, four finger stick glucose measurements per day is no longer a requirement to obtaining coverage. The Medicare criteria that are needed and should be placed in the assessment section of the note are that the patient is treated with insulin, at least three injections per day, and that can be sliding scale, insulin to carb ratio, or via pump. They must have frequent insulin dose adjustments based upon glucose data, either sensor glucose data or finger stick glucose data. They must have had a visit with an MD, NP, or PA within the last six months and six months thereafter. It is a medical, not a pharmacy benefit under Part B. All Medicare patients will need to purchase through durable medical company suppliers, not a pharmacy. Given that statutes dictate coverage through Medicare, appeals are not possible, unfortunately as they may be with commercial insurers. What else to remember regarding Medicare coverage? So once started, patients with Medicare will require six monthly or biannual visits. It may be more frequent for some who will need three monthly visits with notes faxed following to maintain coverage. And these notes will need to obtain those documented requirements. So, you know, are they requiring the three injections per day? frequent adjustment based upon glucose data, and are they seeing their provider at the recommended time frames. The DME company that patients obtain their CGM from may be different from the one that they obtain their machine testing supplies from, so that's also important to remember. Unfortunately, Medicare will not cover testing supplies for patients on the Dexcom G6. Now I'm going to talk about Medicaid coverage for CGM. So what about Medicaid coverage? It's much more sporadic and it varies greatly from state to state. 21 states currently have fairly comprehensive Medicaid coverage of CGM for people with any type of diabetes. However, 22 states only have coverage for people living with type 1 diabetes. Seven states have no published coverage. Who qualifies differs greatly from state to state and most states do require prior authorization. Patients will need to check with their state's Medicaid program for specific eligibility criteria and reach out to the distributor or durable medical supplier. Thank you for listening, and if you'd like to learn more about Time and Range, please visit the American Diabetes Association's Time and Range website at professional.diabetes.org forward slash time and range. Mm -hmm.